Nice. Love the uh, love TikTok memes. All right, Lucina versus Youngling. Okay, so he's going Youngling. He doesn't want to suffer. Lucina versus Yink. Here we go. We'll be seeing a lot of Yink next week at the Pinnacle. Uh, Why do you say that? Because too many cooks and Alphacans are going. Oh, hey. Too many cooks and Alphacans are both very, very good players and also very good young ones. So that'll be fun to watch, probably not to play against, but you know. I do I do enjoy watching Young Link, but man, playing yeah. against Young Link I'm, can be I'm really stressful. I haven't, I haven't played one, I think. Yeah, I haven't. So starting the match out, I don't really know what makes this character good. I just assume projectiles because the shields in this game are It's garbage. projectiles, speed, and like, it, uh, it's just yeah. a combination of the two because like, he's actually really speedy. He this has like not a huge disjoint, but it's still it's, it's still, still good. a sword. You have a Nair similar. You have a sex kick, which yeah, is really good. Those are good. You have a good forward air, nice, good, long lasting back air, and you have the better down airs of the the mini links. I like to say because yeah, I think the long lasting down air, kind of like clouds, is just better. Yeah, it's nice for you can landing. Drift with it. It's hard to challenge because it's a sword and strong. And even if it's not actually hard to challenge, people probably don't want to mess with it just because it's so like uh, it's scary if you get hit by it. So yeah, Tulin's got some stuff, I guess. I've, I've heard his arrows are good. They look like they remind me of like Calco lasers in melee. Gonna come back just, on stage. They're so much faster. They're so quick. I like the idea of the read, but not gonna come through for festival there. Festival is seen as pretty good. He almost uh almost beat me week one or day three rather. I guess it's the same thing. But air dodge not gonna make it. But also he didn't make it. So we're at two stocks, five minutes. Like Smash 4 for glory. It really is it. Except you wouldn't uh, find this stage on Smash 4 for yeah, glory. You or, were stuck or, to. Or uh, one of these characters. Yeah, you're stuck to FD. When you play online, do you pick Battlefield? Do you pick? I uh, don't, don't play don't? online. Oh, okay. I don't hate myself. But uh, yeah. I I'm, I'm gonna be playing online with certain people. I've, I've heard online is garbage in this game, and it wasn't that great in Smash 4. So it's pretty uh, bad. Miss, yeah. miss me with that. I'd rather just play people that live five minutes away from me. Which is what I do. The Otis House? Yeah. Yeah, smart. Sick. We tried to get the landing back here, but two links up tilt actually out range, so that was interesting. Just a grab, no combo. Put a catch the landing to no avail. Ooh, oh no, that? that was really weird. Uh, I wonder if he was trying to tether and he just missed the tether. That could be. I don't know. I don't think tethers are very good in this game. I'd much rather up the. Because the benefits to tethers in Smash 4 where they were fast and you got off ledge with like zero end lag. But in this game, like their range isn't that good and also you have regular ledge lag. So mm -hmm. you might as well protect yourself with an actual hitbox like Yink up B in this case. But that's just me. That's what I do at least. Oh man. I'm tired. It's been a long day. I woke up at 3 a.m. Oh shit! It's been I, a long week for me too. Because I, I, I tried to nap yesterday at six. <laughs> oh, I, I saw your tweet. I, 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 I did see your tweet where you uh, stayed up super late. I, no, I, I went to bed. Really oh no, 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 no! How you woke up at 3 a.m. Yeah, because I was like, oh, I'll just have a nap and like maybe wake up at nine, make myself some dinner, stay up for a couple more hours, and go to bed. And then I just fell asleep at six, and then I woke up at 3 p.m. 3 a.m. No more need to sleep because I just rested for nine hours. So yeah, it's been it's been a long day. Your boy's been awake for uh, what is it? 17 hours. Mm. Oh, up smash! Not gonna kill. Toon Link up smash doesn't doesn't do that much damage. Doesn't kill that well, but no, it's still. It's a just smash because guy. ceilings in this game are so much higher than they've ever been before. Is that true? Yeah, I, I okay. think just things just don't kill off the top as easily as they're used to. I think that's just because Ooh, the devs probably saw things killing off the top was boring, and also. Killing off the top is like definitely so much better than killing off the side since like no matter where you are, you're always gonna die at the top at the same time. Yeah, that's fair. Because we're on a flat level. Yeah. But at the ledges, if you're on a far side and shooting this way, you might not die. Nice. Uh, nice. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, nice go off, run off counter by uh, Festival. And Kane's gonna lose game one. I think he should switch to DK because DKs are good against swords. They, yeah, we, they have lost perfect shield. Also, DK is sick in this game. He's so cool. You can do short hop down B into like up He's smash. so much cooler than he was in the last game. Last yeah, game, all he did was, was grab. It's like Bowser. Bowser's cool in this, cooler in this game, too. Yeah, there we go. DK, baby, coming through. Are you excited to fight Snake? 
Uh, not really, because I never fought one before, but it's a, it's a learning experience, so. Gonna go to the uh, Castlevania stage. Pick Castlevania vampire, FD. Though. I like this. DK good on FD, because he can do this. Uh, well, up, continue up air, usually. And uh, the heavy, or er, swords and have platform suppression. What do you mean you're off the chop spiel, Bailey? That was, I said that too. Yeah, there's the C. Is he listening to the stream? And my uh, dude, all he just wants to do is he's picking DK. He's going for which, by the way, down down B up smash doesn't work yet. It works at like uh, 90, 100. So you just down B and it slaps him up. Yeah, you like just ground land. The ground bounces just them and you yeah. just like, so all right, cool. That's that's pretty sick. So actually, really, it's a really easy input. You just down B on your landing and uh, you up smash when you're above them. And when up smash stops connecting, you can do sh stuff like full hop up air and then kills, of course, because they're at like 120. But DK is just good in general. He has nice tilts. His dash is good. He's got a really good back air. I mean, DK's always had a really good back yeah, air. Yeah, it's it's it's, almost, it's Mario esque. It's fantastic. Yeah, it's aerial cool spinning Kong. I remember Kong was mentioning frustration with that move. I mean, it's like it's fine. It's different in a lot of ways. It does less damage, but the trade off is it has actual knockback now, so it's not unsafe on hit. Which I think is fine. I didn't like getting combo break by an invincible up B that also it's not invincible anymore. But uh, yeah, I don't. I didn't like getting combo break by an invincible up B that happened to do 30%. Yeah, was, I was. I wasn't oof. a fan of that. But festival. Yeah, the counter is so the powerful. First stock coming through. Yeah, counter such a powerful tool against people with recoveries like that. In, ooh, nice falling up air. Gonna get the up tilt. Catch the landing. Ooh. Just missed times his up tilt and gets hit by DK falling there. So the thing about DK is, uh, you know, DK has always had a very bad disadvantage state. And with a sword in this game, it's so easy to push something like that. So when you get DK in the air, you really got to make it count. Yeet. See you later. I love that. That's so funny. I, I'm a big fan of everyone at Don't Park just yelling yeet whenever Kong that. Was, that. that was an entire crowd of people that just all yelled yeet. Yeah, it was sick. I said Kongo didn't beat Sam. It's okay. And another reality, Kongo went Don't Park, and that's the best reality, but it's not the one we live in. The best reality would have been Big D or Landon, actually. Right yeah, I mean, out of everyone that was left. But yeah, I would have been, I would have been cool with Dawson winning. That would have been sick. It's sad that... Uh, oh, very nice parry. Oh I would have got shield broken and died. Uh, <laughs> he had the balls to parry that. Yeah, I guess he did. He wasn't going to die because of cross stage and DK, but... Still, yeah, it takes some uh, takes some guts to parry stuff like that. We got out on the dancing blade, not gonna connect fully. And ooh, interesting high up B to avoid the counter. And I think that was smart. He's learning from the last a, mistake that uh, happened to cause him to die. Ooh, nice air dodge into the ledge. F till not gonna kill, but it's close. It's hard to see DK on the stage. It maybe is that, tough. Maybe that's why he kind of picked it. I don't know. That'd no, be no, funny. No. That'd be funny if he did. I think he just likes the aesthetic. Yeah. Could be. Got the nice moon in the background. Not gonna keep him safe. The knockback that is. Ooh. Tried to run up, grab festival. Saw it. Saw it through it rather. Jumped over it. Got a nice landing back air. Oh, cool. And he's pushing his advantage state. Kane not really knowing what to do. I mean, you can you can have an idea of what to do, but you're also DK, so sometimes it doesn't matter because your character is so bad at disadvantage. Is he gonna get yeeted? See you later. But not gonna kill. The magnet hands are too strong. Yeah, magnet hands still in this game. Not as relevant as Smash 4, but they are definitely still there. Back here gonna catch the jump in. F Smash, not gonna take it, but he's far out. F smash again, up smash, better choice. No, it's best of five. Best of five, Kane. Best of five, so now we'll see if Kane can pull off the reverse 3 0. But man, reverse 3 0 is just, it's an uphill climb, man. Uh, it can yeah. happen, but in a game like Smash, it's more grueling than, in, say, in a game like Tekken. You have to, you have to win on your opponent's counter pick uh, twice. Yeah. Which, which can be tough. But, you know, if they can do it, so can you. Some say, or uh, maybe people say that. I don't he know. He has a Kirby, but I don't think he's going to go uh, Kirby. I don't think Kirby against Swords is, is the play. But DK still going to probably be yeah. pretty good. DK will be fine. Going back to FD, what's your opinion on that? FD, I think it's fine. Uh, yeah, I think it's good. He probably banned our... 
or Fessel, I don't know what Fessel's been, if not at least. Interesting. But yeah, very good landing by there, or right there. And he's doing a really good job using his grounded movement. He's using dash attack a lot, which is fine. DK's dash attack is really good. It's yeah. like a good burst option, does a lot, it's a good amount of percent. Does a good amount of percent, and it puts you in a good uh, spot to hit them. Just more. lasts so long. Yeah, that's it's, a tra true. it's a traveling, of course, it gets a dash attack, travels too, it's super nice. Just covers a lot. And he's a, DK's a big body, so it's a big yeah, hitbox. Yeah, a good, uh... Oh, sorry, everyone. That's okay. Good, no worries. Oh, I almost broke the shield. He would have died if he got hit with the shield broke. But F Smash, not going to take it. Having good burst options on the ground this game is super important because dashing is like such a thing that everyone does. Like Dashing has uh, changed uh, as opposed to how people would run up and shield in Smash 4. Yeah, you can just kind of... You still do it, of course. We just saw it now. That, it's not that great in this game. That's, that's people still being used to Smash 4. Getting yeeted out of there. See you later. But uh, yeah, it's uh, having good grounded options is real or fast like mobile grounded options is really good because people dash back a lot for defense because shielding's kind of sucky in this game. Yeah. So if you have a move that can catch somebody's dash back, then uh, you're set, man. MK dash attack, hit dash attack, you know, Fox. Fox dash attack Fox for sure. Dash attack, you know, all these moves are even Sonic are, are dash really tag. good in games like this. He's gonna catch. He didn't. He recognized he didn't have a follow-up or a combo there, so he just wait. He just threatened with a full hop and then tried to catch the landing. And Kane's doing nice this game. The Yeet not gonna kill. <laughs> gonna go for the uh, the down throw. A beautiful catch for or the, the jump. down air rather. And yeah, catches the jump with the up air. Gonna take gonna take the first stock, but he's down by quite a bit. And especially against DK, this character is fat and doesn't really die very easily, so. He's down a full stock, might as well be like a hundred. That's super unfortunate. That's the that's the air dodge buffer coming in. But uh, you know, he's been Wow, he taunted too. You know, I, I hope that doesn't shake shake him because he's been doing really well this game anyways. So I think if he if he just keeps like keep a level head and plays the way he's been oh my god, freaking full hop fair towards him, up air <laughs> or jab, that was crazy. Kane is nuts. Ooh, misses the combo. Goes goes to the get up attack, which is actually fine. Get up attacks are like pretty good in this game. They because have, they have iframes now. Yeah. They have invincibility they now. They used to suck so bad, but now it's like if you catch them, you're just pushing buttons on ledge because they feel like it. Get up attack is uh, it's nice. Varys, what nice the balls? Parry again, he's, yeah, so, he's crazy. I don't think he would have died if he got uh, shield. No, he wouldn't, there, but it's still crazy to see. Yeah, it's still nice. You know, practice. You know, last last stock of your tournament potentially to get shield broken. No, it's just parry practice, man. And he's just dashing around menacingly. DK's dash is kind of spooky. Ooh, very nice cross up there. <laughs> yeah, he can do quite a lot out of it. Get Ooh. the down tilt. Tries to fade away fair, but the hitbox doesn't actually come out. Unfortunate. That's gonna be a kill. Ding. See ya. Squeezes you with his big DK arms. So let's think what he's gonna ban. Gonna ban Probably Triplats. Castle Siege. Or Castle Siege, yeah. Castle Siege is a bad stage and really good for swords. Yeah, man. That's the thing. Yeah. They're gonna keep going back to the stage. Pick a difference. Oh, damn it. They did it. Oh, I mean, they still can, but. They're gonna, they're gonna keep getting Vampire Killer. Which is really good, Castlevania 1 love. Unless they get a uh, Bloody Tears. Nope, it's Vampire Killer, yeah. All right, gonna start the match off. Better than he did last time, I think. But, ooh, nice up tilt to catch the ending. DK's up tilt is very good. It's always been a good move. But now that he can do it out of a dash, it seems like it's almost yeah, even it's better nice. in some cases. You it's can nice. Run, you can run with them and up tilt to catch their landings. Yeet so you him. Yeet you him. Put him off stage, try to catch the up B with the down air. And a lot of Lucinos will, or a lot of Marcinas will nair from ledge. Just like it's, a, it's a good move. Yeah. If you drop a low ledge and then nair on your way up, it, it gives you, it protects you with the hitbox the whole time. Their nairs have always been traditionally good since, like, you know, mainly oh, he four. Grabbed that really. That's crazy. Not gonna kill Dancing Blade, that is. 
High recovery. Oh, wow. That's unfortunate. Yeah, that's unfortunate. He's facing the wrong way. Good recovery by Kane. Jumped, faking. He's gonna go in and drift back to ledge. That's a classic. Pretty good mix up. Not amazing, but you know, it's there. Oh, very nice. He reads across him there that time with the up tilt. Uh, misses the turnaround, and you're gonna get heated out of there. That's so funny, man. It's just weird. Instead of ding dong, you just you just get <laughs> you get bear hugged right off it's, the stage. It's, it's it okay, looks so though, dorky. It doesn't work at 60. Instead, it works at like 160. So it's fine. Oh no, totally. I'm, that's a way healthier uh, thing. Gonna recover, no problem. DK at 170. He is living. But this sword gonna be hard to get in on with space right. See if he can do it. He tries to randy F smash. Not gonna. There was so find much pressure. There. Like, there was so much hitbox being flown out that it kind of looked like Kane really yeah. didn't have an option to kind of. Yeah, it was maybe it was, maybe I can F smash to get my way in. But. Good. Ooh, re grab. Gets another up air. Ooh, interesting. I don't really know if I agree with the counter there. He was too close to throw like a good hitbox, so he probably just wanted to grab anyways. Up tilt to catch the dash in. Ooh, interesting roll. Lots of stuff safe on shield right here. Pestle missing the counter. Kane is going high a lot of the time. Ooh, Whoa. yeah, can't take that. I mean, you can, but he did. He didn't. Festival's uh, missing a lot of these counters on these recoveries, and that was really good. But the direction air dodge in, but he's a fatty. DK, He's not gonna die. Big boy. Ah, he missed the. He could have run the F smash, that would have been really good, but fortunately not. These F tilts are working, though. Uh, counter gonna kill, yeah. Kane doesn't recover high, and uh, he pays for it with his stock. That was also a very consistent thing in Smash 4. Ooh, so 60, it's, ouch! It's nice for the Marcinas that it carried over. Fair to grab. Oh, this is the combo. Probably. I would assume that was actually the short hop buffer coming in because he definitely got a short hop up air when full hop up air would have connected and probably combined into something else. What happened to his switch? Anyways, back to this game. Kane has like 60% uh, lead. Oh, missed the punish on the held up beat. Back throw, not gonna take it, but he's far out there. I mean, good dash to get out of the way, just not messing with it. Get up attack. Now, Festival is a kill percent for like a lot of things. Nair's not one of them, but lots of throws. Back air, back air will kill. Up back air almost kill. did it. Risky dash attack. Good. Nice recovery. High recovery. High. Gonna Dude, take yeah. the ending lag just so he can get back on stage. I mean, he, he goes pretty much center stage, so yeah. he has to dash after to get him. Nice. I like the laser. He's soft very landing. patient. Ooh, I don't agree with that F smash. Oh my god. Yeah, he's dead. No, he should have done the. Uh... I mean, that works. I mean, it works. And he's he's, Dude, he's back on the to journey to the reverse 3-0. Yeah, it is. This is happening. So we'll see what what's going on if he can. If he can complete this reverse 3-0. Not sure if it's going to happen, but we shall see. I think they went back. I don't agree with Festival just going back. I feel like he should actually counter pick a stage. But you should go to Battlefield. Game three. Or sorry. Blah, my bad. Game five. I, I, would, I would take DK to Battlefield. I think Battlefield's really good for sorties, and I just think it's like really gross for DK to land. That's true. By, by taking him to FD, you're just giving him the power. Yeah, you're giving him up airs. You're giving him up air time. He's going to catch him without a jump. But he he just kind of ran up to him when he was shielding and didn't grab it. Interesting. Up to up, oh up, to up smash. Up to up smash. Kill, what? But I guess that's a combo. That's kind of cool. Dash attack, not going to kill, but... Charge that massive punch. Yeah, that move big. I feel like it... Oh, he tried to cross up, but not gonna happen. Oh, he beautiful the high recovery this time. Not gonna kill. I suggest he up be high. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Up be. That's not, that's not gonna make it back. Yeah, he's dead. Uh, Festival taking the early lead game three. Only 45 seconds yeah. in. But I feel like he could just hit him like really hard with something, and that's gonna yeah. be it. Back air, ledge kill. But he's gonna down smash. Watch this. No, I'm kidding. Yeah, <laughs> nair from ledge is really hard to deal with this game, especially because she looks worse. Yeah. The, nair's, good the stuff. nair is quite safe, but in Smash 4, it was down just smash. like, 
Oh, no, DK down smashes the play. No, no, no. I just thought it was kind of funny. There he's gonna eat him. Gonna eat, eat him. him out of here. He's dead actually. He can't. He straight up can't make that back. That's really funny. Charge the punch. He just got the punch now. I don't know how much armor. He he game, like but. keeps an angry face when he has the punch charge. Yeah, he has, like, the, That's so funny. Like, grin eyes. That's a DK jungle beat. That's a uh, 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 like the, yeah the, the weird uh, the game. It's the face he makes. The angry oh. face. Nice. Reads the tech in, I think. Or maybe not red, but he just waited nice. for it. Nice. I like the patience here. Out of okay. Up tilts are gonna clash. Good near here. Oh, Festival's yeah. in the right position to catch this jump. This is what sorties want to do their best. They want to catch jumps. Yeah, they just want to keep you in the air with their big, fast, lagless hitboxes, which is what they're all good at in this game. Ooh, bad Nair into his shield, gonna get him grabbed. You know, things can be safe in this game, but if you're, just, if you're just jumping into people, holding forward, you know, stuff's gonna get punished. Ca covers the landing. Ah, uh, tries to go for the ding dong there. Like not the cargo throw would have hit him. Car grounded cargo throw up throw rather. Okay. Good back, back air. End. That sends him kind of low. Ah, uh, again, beautiful down beat. The yeah, counter's gonna really take it. Kane's gonna have to really think about how he wants to finish Ooh. this off. Was he gonna send him back onto stage? He's, no, he tr he tried to go for the stage spike, but uh, he realized Festival was mashing, so it was he thought maybe he needs the, the time, damage, right? By the time the Festival would have got off there. Or by the time they got off stage, Festival would have matched up. So yeah. Oh, Ooh, this is really good for Festival. It's a nice 57% already. Or 51, excuse me. But now he's at 64. He's gonna just trap his landings. He's can't struggle to find a way. Oh, no yeah, parry there. More full off forward air uh, into shield break. It looks like pretty good pressure against heavies. Yeah. If they elect to stay in shield, that is. He's just trying to look for an option. Gonna get hit off with the back air. This is looking grim. Eat and last stock game five. Ladies Can and he gentlemen. do this? I Can know. He do it? Yeah, we saw Sarango bring it back. Ninety-one percent. Nothing. Nothing. Nothing too bad for DK. I would. I would start worrying around like. Oh, this is scary. He's in the air now. Oh, he's gonna land. Okay, Very cool. nice back air spacing. Ooh. Oh my Tries God. to cover himself Whoa. with the jab. Festival lands. I. It's funny. Him. Festival kind of retreated as he was landing. Trying maybe trying to cast something. I don't know. And Kane's moving right now. Oh Festival gosh, not really ready for Whoa, it. Beautiful. Gonna try to go uh, for the grab. He missed the grab. He rolled on. Tries to go for F smash yeah, here. He wants to, to get the he's, kill. He's fishing for it a little bit. But bad dash tag. Back gonna send throw. him off stage. Ooh, he go. misses the back air. That actually might cost him the set. Oh, it's gonna get this. Not gonna kill. I like that. Staying to the lip. Oh! That's gonna kill. Yeah, man. Almost a reverse 3-0. So, almost a reverse 3-0. Kane's uh, showing off. He's super yeah. good. Very nice stuff by both of them. He covered him at the end. Uh, he DI'd the ledge trump in. Damn, Josh. Why you had to do that?